Hey everybody, Ann here, just sitting here finishing up my coffee, and I'm kind of in a mood, and you know what I like to do when I'm in a mood? I like to go dig a hole. <laughs> so it's, it's going to be a very specific hole, and it's going to be a hole with a purpose. So I don't know if I can accomplish it today, but it's going to be relatively cool outside, very, very wet. So, today is a good day when the ground is kind of wet, kind of soft. So, I'm going to see if I can get this done. I got this much done already. And a nice bucket is filled. And can you guys guess? Can you guess what I'm trying to do? Oh my gosh, I think that's... Oh, check this out, you guys. Lukey! Oh my gosh, Mr. Lucas is mowing down my meadow. Oh, he's the best. It's crazy high. Let's see if we can get him to, to wave at us. Looks like he got his lawnmower fixed. Oh my gosh, look how high it is. Oh my goodness. Woohoo! Look at that, it's all the way up to his shoulders. Hi, Mr. Lucas! <laughs> He's too busy. What's up, dude? You having fun? Woo. Oh, he's so awesome. I'm gonna get a lot of this and put it in the chicken yard. There you go, sweet babies. Oh, here comes Mama. <laughs> I'm gonna spread some more all around the yard. I don't even know if you can see this because of the sun, but they love eating grass clippings. There you go, BBL. Get yourself some nummies. You too, Rocky Three. I think I'm going to call that white leghorn Dovey. Yeah, Dovey. She makes me kind of think of a Dovey. And you too, Bard Rocks. Yeah, if I scatter it all over the place, everybody gets a chance to eat some. I've made a little bit of progress. Not much, but it's got to be much deeper. Because not only do I need it to be deep enough for what I need it to be, <laughs> um, I need it to be a couple inches deeper because i got to put some stuff in the bottom of it. So that, um, and maybe even up the sides, to kind of protect the walls and, uh, and protect the floor and um, I don't know it's gonna it's gonna take me forever but it's fixing to rain here in a little bit so I'm gonna cover this up and hopefully it won't fill with water it might hope it doesn't but yeah this is gonna take me probably a week to dig well it has stopped raining long enough for me to take Papa for a little walk and then it's gonna start raining again Oh, these chickens in this yard, they're so muddy, but they don't seem to mind. So, come on, boy, let's go for a walk. Papa's going to freak out when he notices that there's not the tall grass anymore. I don't think he really liked running through it. He just really didn't. But he sure loves going. Oh, oh, look, look. Oh, it's not a mushroom. Nope, it's a seed from a tree. <laughs> I got mushrooms on the brain. Papa, look, what's that? What is it? Let's go see what it is. Yep, that's a mushroom. And it is not an edible one. No, they, uh, they grow all over the place here. Um, gosh, I think this is a, well, it's a veiled mushroom. You can see a veil down on, underneath of there. Uh, it's not a death cap, but I don't know. All I know is I can't eat it. See, here's another one. Yeah, come on, Papa. He doesn't like the mushrooms. Yep. Oh, yeah. See, <laughs> you can see them better now. See that? That little skirty thing? That's a veil. Um, it's not a death cap, but I don't think it's a poisonous one, but I still, I think it's like a, some kind of Amanita, and you can't eat them. I love the smell of my property after the lawn has been freshly mowed. You can't see my face very good. 
but it's a good feeling. Um, poor Mr. Lucas and his lawn mower, he's had such trouble with it and he loves to keep his lawn looking good and it's it has always looked really good but he hasn't been able to mow as much lately as he'd like to. I keep looking for mushrooms. Um, gosh, I wish there was a way we could get him a new, a new uh, lawn mower. But those things are pretty expensive. Yeah, I don't think we're going to find any more mushrooms, you guys. <laughs> yeah, I need to focus on Papa. He needs to, he needs to take a tinkle. <gasps> I wonder if this is one of those... I'm not sure. Oh, I would love it if it was one of these uh, orange milkies. Uh, no, it is not. I don't know if it's a milky or not. I'd have to... Here, hang on. See, I cut it and it is not like oozing anything. Gosh, I sure wish I knew what this was. Let me get a good look at this and I'll look it up in my book. But I've seen these many times and I don't think these are edible. It's not one of those veiled mushrooms in Almanita. Um, it might be a arusula mushroom. I'm not really sure, but they sure are pretty. I would sure love to find out if you can eat these. It's so weird because I was out here this morning and that mushroom was not here. It definitely was not here. Um, right here in this area, kind of like by these trees, is where I found those bolites, the bicolor bolites. And um, I've seen them here before. There's not any here now, but I don't know. I think they'll show up again sometime soon. What do you think, Papa? He could not be more unconcerned about my mushroom endeavors. All right, let's get serious about your walk now, okay? Let's get serious about your walk. Yeah, we got to get serious about this walk. I hear thunder in the distance, so that means it's going to rain pretty soon. Well, the rain has not arrived yet, and it's kind of cool, so I'm sitting out on the porch and enjoying my last little bit of daylight before I have to put the chickens up. Well, the chickens put themselves up, but I just go lock them in. Pup has been a good boy, and that's basically it today. <laughs> it is. I went into town. Uh, tomorrow, I'm going to work on that hole a little bit more. Have you figured it out yet? Have you? <laughs> Anyhow, um... That's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.